Hey everyone, Brent Thompson here with MCT Productions. I'm going to go through and I'm going to show you guys all the different ways to mount your Tacticam so that you can make a great bow fishing video. I'm going to show you all the different main shots, even some B-roll ideas in this video. I'm going to show you guys each mount I use and how to use them and then I'm going to show you guys an actual clip of me bow fishing using it. All right, first we're going to start with the standard bow mount package it comes with your stabilizer mount this is by far the simplest way to attach your tacticam but bow fishing gets real crazy and moving and reeling and it honestly isn't the best footage it gets the shot really well and you got to remember to hold your reel as like steady as possible when you're reeling i've found to tuck the bow under my arm and reel so then when you're reeling you can see the bow isn't going nuts. I mean, it still wiggles, but that's by far the best way I've found to do it is to tuck your bow tight under your arm and then reel. So we'll show you a clip from the stabilizer mount. Next is the head mount. The whole head mount strap comes with the universal mount. You can place it so it's on the front of your head or you can twist it and position it so it is on the side of your head. It's all personal preference and this is where the 4.0 comes in real nice handy with the Wi-Fi app because now I can go on my phone, turn it on set my phone in front of me or have my buddy hold it and I could shoot in the water and see on the screen where it is hitting and try to get it as center as possible that's the nice part about the 4.0 so that is the head mount I'll show you a clip from that Next feature I really like are the selfie stick type arms. Not only can you use the selfie stick with you get the quarter thread bolt base adapter, like the tripod adapter, and you can put the tech cam mount on it. But you can then if you want to do any type of attaching with straps or anything. You can put it on any of your pipes on your boat, have it up above. What I really like is this fourth arrow arm. This thing gets super long and I can take the base. It comes with a base that is adjustable. And in the back I can take a piece of wood. And I made a little platform. And I have it strapped down on the bottom of the boat and I take the base and I stick this into it so it's sticking way up in the air. And I'll show you a clip of that for the view from the back of the boat shining on the back of us while we're up on the deck and it gets a more broad view. So show you we use this selfie stick here this is a real long one and we put the 2.0 in the holder and we can go underwater and we'll do underwater shots I'll reach way out and get by the fish and we'll do underwater shots the next one is a lot of like cool b-roll footage I'd call it. It's a roll bar mount. It goes on my bar here. I have it right on the bar back here behind me facing the front of the boat 
and I can get shots of driving down a nice country road or going to the launch. I can turn the tech cam backwards, get shots of driving. I can even put it forward going down the river, driving, stuff like that, just little clips, filler footage. Also, put the Tacticam in it for when you're shooting. It does not show the shooters well. It just shows like waist down, but it shows out in front of the boat. So any shots out towards the front of the boat, you can get them that way. There's even another option of the octopus style arms. Same thing, you get the attachment for the tripods, screw right on, and now you can attach this all around spots on your boat. You can get side angles, you can do pretty much anything. Like I was saying, stating before, you can pretty much use any GoPro ac accessory and whatever your mind and imagination will think up on how to mount it and use it, it will work. I hope all these tips help out and you guys can be putting together some of your own bow fishing videos.